Hey guys, Dogden here. I am an English football fan who loves going to different matches and I'm flying over to Naples to watch Napoli versus Salatana for potentially the Syria title lift, the Scudetto. Going back to the south of Italy, it is going to be insane. There's going to be a carnival. I can't wait to go. Let's get on that flight and just experience what could be something special. The last time they won it, it was with Maradona. Now Cavaradona and Osimhen and all the lads. Let's get over there. <laughs> <laughs> we're just driving around the city and you won't believe what we've just seen ahead this is unbelievable the traffic has been stopped they're already getting ready over 20 years they've been waiting for a scudetto finally they've got their chance behind us up the street is curva b which is one of the ultras groups now we're going to go see the curva a which is the other one apparently it's going off in another part of the city somewhere else in the square look at this you can see them getting ready for the match the pyro is out Blue and white everywhere. This city's being shut down. It's being completely shut down. Kavarit Skelly on the back of the shirt, 77. We're going to see a lot of these colours today. I'm suited now. I've seen the atmosphere going on around the city. I now feel part of it. This street, okay, compare it to here. Diego Maradona on the front. Napoli flags, decorations all over. Blue and white, different flags, everything. And when I say it's like every street, it's just like this. Weeks of efforts into making the city prepared for the moment that they win the league and it could happen today. Two train tickets to get there and back after the match. This is the only form of travel because all roads are closed. So why are we already heading to the stadium like five hours early? Well, let me explain. At 12.30 kickoff, there is Inter versus Lazio and that determines whether Napoli will win the Serie A today. If Lazio win, there's no chance for Napoli. If they draw or lose, to Inter, then they can win it today. And that's what we've flown here for, so fingers crossed they don't. Napoli, Campione d'Italia. Look at this train. That's quality. Even the trains have got dressed up. Their third Scudetto, 22-23 season. That's proper. I don't know what's going on. It's mad. Talk about living life on the edge here. Look at this. On the platform. On the platform. Inter has begun. I'm getting the face paint here. The end. How do I look? Everyone celebrating. Go! Inter's gone! Inter's gone! Yes! The pyro's going off. Bad news here outside the Diego Maradona Stadium. The goal was disallowed. And to make matters worse, Lazio scored. Which means they won't win the league today. It'll be at Udinese next week away. Fingers crossed they turn it around. Come on, Inter. Yeah, grazie, grazie. Very good. The ultras are ready. Napoli fan club UK. Unreal. All eyes on one screen. Inter nil, Lazio one. That match depends on what happens today. No. No, 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 no. Inter getting so close. Inter may have just done Napoli a massive favour. Oh my god. That is 50% of the job done. Thank you, Inter. But you left it late. Why did you have to leave it till the 18th minute? If Napoli win today, they win. Their third Scudetto. Right, now for sure it's done. 3-1 Inter. Now it's down to Napoli to beat their local rivals. Look how busy it is. There's about 30 minutes till kickoff because people watching the last game is getting very heated on entry. You are going to win the league. <laughs> Here we are. 
Welcome to the Diego Maradona Stadium for Napoli's third Scudetto. Everybody's here. Nine minutes till kick -in. This is something else. Lozano, Osimhen. Almost 19 minutes gone, it's still nil nil. This game is going on, it's dragging on. Is it it? Oh. Ochoa saves. That's more like it for Napoli. That's half time here. Napoli nil, Salernitana nil. Today you win the league. Come on. Yeah. You think yeah. so? Yeah. Good luck. It's been a difficult half. KG. They need to find that one moment. Here come the players once again. 45 minutes to determine if they're going to win the league today or not. Let's see if they can do it. We're underway again for the second half. Look at all the flags. Look at all the pyro. Look at what it means. This is bad. Could this be the moment? has completely erupted it's done the third time to Napoli and as an English football fan you don't see experiences like this in my country to come here and experience it now look around me fireworks players decorations flags passion everything I can't see the pitch it's almost like the football doesn't matter anymore Porta Magnifica indeed. Everyone's swaying.
Clara. does not do it. Means it have to go get two days on Thursday. No matter what, they're still singing. Why won't Skelly up? Has it ever been a time? It has to be now. How do you miss the whole goal? Salona could have won it there and then. It's the 90th minute. They're not winning the league today this way. It's just not meant to be. It's so heartbreaking about this result. It means that Napoli will win. Can be there to appreciate that moment. That's full time. Claps all on the ground, but no Scudetto today. One thing I did appreciate today was the atmosphere and how much, how many flags, the passion, how much it meant to the people of the city. They're going to win the league next week anyway. But being here and taking it all in. With all the ultras, has been something else. They love football here. They'll die for it. A draw, but a great experience. Napoli will be champions third time very soon. Bye bye.